Dean KK4DAS here. I'm putting final finishing touches on my homebrew SBITX uh, transceiver. Uh, I've been chasing down a problem for a little while where the rig occasionally, the relay that switches from uh, receive to transmit turns on when it's not supposed to. And um, I posted about this a, a, a bit ago and Pete Giuliano had suggested um, that I replace the 2N3904 transistor with a, a TIP 31C and also that I um, increase the value of the, the dropping resistor that goes to the base of the transistor from 220 ohm to 2.2K. I didn't have any TIP 31Cs. I replaced the 2N3904 uh, with a new one and then uh, put a 2.2K in and it seemed to be working for a while but then it started doing it again. So basically I turned the rig on and I'd hear the relay clicking even though I wasn't doing anything. And I started trying to diagnose it. The basic circuit is this. The um, Raspberry Pi has a GPIO line that is supposed to go high when uh, you go into transmit. And when it goes in high, it turns on the transistor, which turns on the relay, and that causes the plus 12 transmit to go everywhere it's supposed to go. Um, I measured the voltage on the GPIO pin and it was sitting right around 0.6 volts when it's in the off position, which is just about at the threshold of turning on the 2N3904, which explains why sometimes it would turn on, sometimes it wouldn't. Um, and so um, I went back to Pete's suggestion and I put uh, built a little test circuit here with a relay and it's not a tip 31, but it's tip 29, which is pretty close to the same, uh, same specs. Um, and its turn on voltage is more like 1.3 volts than 0.6. And so it should not um, be a problem. And I'm testing it right now. So it's actually in the circuit. Uh, it is um, got no volts at the output, which is what I expect, which means, the, which means the transistor is off. I'm looking basically at the output of the relay. When the transistor turns on, it should put plus 12 or you know VCC on the relay. So just go into transmit and see what happens. There we go, 13.8 and off. And transmit and receive. So I think all I need to do now is go back to this board and rip off this little 2N3904 and replace it with a TIP29, which I have a couple of them in the bag, and it should be good to go.